So Fiona, tell us about the lifestyle content in the Wall Street Journal Europe. Uh, well, we, it, it, it's, first of all, it's very broad. Um, we, um, we have a weekly uh, section that comes out every Friday um, and it's within the tabloid format and it's called Off Duty. Uh, people might know that from the off-duty section in the US, um, which, uh, which has a particular brief, but we have, uh, in Europe, we have a slightly wider brief, so we try to cover everything from um, adventure and travel to um, culture, and uh, we also incorporate a lot of the material that would go into say the US mansion section so we have property in there but of course um, some of the key stuff are um, the fashion material that we do for both um, aimed at both men and women uh, so we have quite a broad scope there uh, we had a great fashion shoot last week for our last one if um, uh, and uh, that was all about florals and prints um, for the chaps, not for uh, not for the women. So, um, you know, we try to really look at the um, lifestyle content from uh, a European perspective because there is a difference. Uh, so we're we're trying to sort of uh, cover Europe and also have those um, threads back to the US as well. How would you describe your relationship with PRs and how they can uh, best help you with content? Well, I hope it's good. <laughs> Um, and I hope that we're also very open um, to being approached. Uh, possibly uh, people don't know where to find us, um, but I think that uh, it starts off with either a phone call or um, an email. Now we have loads of those things like everyone else. Um, so uh, I think it really comes down to the PRs knowing our product. Um, the off-duty section, we also have um, a twice yearly watches and jewellery section um, and also there are uh, occasional feature material during the week. So if, if the PRs know, know, the, um, know the paper uh, and then it's sort of down to luck being in the right place at the right time and knowing that that's, that's the material, um, that it, it's just falling into you know, the right spot, the sweet spot. Um, it's actually, I don't think there's a formula for it. So, um, yeah, just, but hopefully we just, you know, take in all the information and then when, when something, you know, relevant pops up, then we know where to go to go and chase it.